So welcome back to some more Skyward Sword. I just figured to skip the flight on over from the Thunderhead over to Skyloft for, uh, well, this is our last place of adventuring, weirdly enough. So we have to find the last trial, and, uh, well, you may be surprised to say that it might be here. See those blessed butterflies? Yeah, I might have lied a little bit when I said that that was the last, uh, Silent Realm. For this is the final one. And the ultimate one. If that doesn't give you chills, I don't know what will. Thrust her sword into the center of the mark and open the way to the final si final silent realm. Are you kidding? <laughs> I really hope you guys can't hear that. So there's some jackass outside blaring his music in his car. Yeah, you gotta love uh, people. Seriously. Anyway. Last one. God, I really hope you guys can't hear that. Future me is going to have a bliss trying to edit that out. <laughs> anyway. Skyloft is the final Silent Realm. And by extension, your final time to try to find any Dusk Relics that you may need. Master Link. You have entered the last of the trials. The Goddess's Silent Realm. Another spirit vessel. Dear God, why does this plant keep coming back? When you have filled the spirit vessel once more, you shall finally be recognized as a true hero of legend. Only then will you be shown to the door that will lead you to the Triforce. Master, I wish you success in this trial. No, I don't have any questions. Understood, Master. I wait your return. Yeah! Skyloft is our final big dungeon area. Um, well, not really dungeon, more like Silent Realm. And it incorporates everything we've seen from the previous trials up to this point. Sacred Tear. It incorporates everything. The pose, the waking water, the weird uh, slicey dudes and the big hammer bros. Everything. First off, I'm gonna grab this tier up here. It's very out of the way, and I suggest just grabbing it. Uh, also, I'm not gonna go out of my uh, way for Dusk Relics, because I don't need them. Uh, oh, I forgot I don't have the uh, the Sailcloth. Yeah, it might have been nice for you, Hylia, to give me something to, you know, not break my fall with my knees with. Uh, anyway. This one's pretty simple, actually. There's not a whole lot of places they could stick these things, so... It's pretty, uh... It's not that bad, in all honesty. As long as you're looking out for the pose, you should be fine. I say that as I almost get caught. Uh, there's Poe down there. I'm just gonna not grab its attention. I recommend just going from the left first, because, um... The left side is the hardest side, in my opinion. So... Anyway... Yeah, there's really nothing to say about this. I mean, this is pretty much another thing they added after the fact so that they can get or squeeze more time out of the game. By the way, be very careful of this uh, sacred tear because, uh, well, you got this Poe going back and forth. I don't think he can see us now. Yeah, no. There we go. Just grab that. I don't think... Oh, there is one up there. Uh, oh, right. I remember. Don't get fooled with that box being there, thinking you have to push that up against the door. Uh, you don't have to do that. You just go over here. Actually, I don't think it will do anything, even if you push that box over there. So, Take the route you did at the very beginning when you saved the cat. 
Who knew that saving account would eventually lead us to this point in the game? <laughs> and can I just say, it is very surreal that we're at this point of the game. I really wanted to land on that, damn it. We have every single collectible thing we can really get. I mean, we've done all the side quests, we've done everything. It feels very surreal because, like, I mean, you know, this, uh, this adventure started in, I think, September? Maybe? Maybe the near, uh, near the end of August. I don't remember. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm the one in charge of my own YouTube schedule, and I don't remember when the hell Let's Play even started, but, I mean, you know, I've been doing this for almost half a year, and it's been fun. And I cannot wait for, uh for more adventures in other games, but we're not at the very end yet. We still have a little, a little bit to go. Just wait for that Poe. And like I said, this spirit realm is pretty easy. Uh, this one's kind of out of the way too, so I'm just gonna go and get it. I haven't seen any dusk relics around here, weirdly enough. Weird. Maybe there is none. I should also clarify that um, last episode with the Thunder Dragon, um, well, besides the amount of uh, yes, difficulties that I had in cutting, um, there are hearts in there. The hearts do stay. Uh, for some reason, I was thinking of uh, Hero Mode's version of it, where there are no hearts, because, well, there's no naturally occurring hearts without the heart metal in that game. Or, yeah, yeah, the heart metal. I always get the heart metal and the life metal mixed up. Let's grab this. Don't walk into the waking water. There we go. And there is a glitch you can do here. Uh, I'm gonna try to do this legitimately first. Oh god. Um, you know what? I'm just gonna piss you off because there's a tier right here. I don't really care. And boom. Easy. It does respawn you. That is... How are you supposed to get that Dusk Relic? Alright, well, let's just wait for you to run back. Uh, yeah, I, I'm not grabbing that Dusk Relic. It's not worth it. I really wanted to get that, but the Poe. That Poe is a real dick, needless to say. Over here. Here is the uh, glitch spot I was talking about, I think, right? Alright, sorry about that interruption. I think is this spot? Let me see. There is a glitch you could do somewhere around here, and I can't remember where... Oh, wait, it's here. I think. Oh, come on. Oh, oh, piss. That's fine. I can't remember exactly where it is, but you can just... Oh, I, I did not know there was waking water here. You can just, like, jump through one of those gates to get behind... I think it is that gate um, that I was looking at to get behind the uh, gate uh, graveyard. So, yeah, um, there's probably speedrunning uh, tips somewhere that will show you that. I've done it before, I just don't remember if that's the... Actually, I think that is the gig, because that's the only one I can think of. Also, this one's kind of a jerkish spot. Grab it. There's the last one! Booyah! Oh, God! Um, please... Thank you. You can still get caught even if you've completed the trial, so just be very wary of that. I wanted to show off that glitch, but I can't... I, you have to, like, glitch into a corner of it or something like that. Oh god, oh god. Uh, no, 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 no. Yeah. I didn't find any dusk relics, though. There's one over by the graveyard. I think there's some behind these boxes. Or there's one behind this box. these boxes? No. Man, I got really unlucky then, because... Usually I find a ton in this area, but, as I said, if this is your last Silent Realm, collect all the Dusk Relics you've seen. If you need more, just wipe yourself and do the trial over again. But, for me, there's no point. We're returning to the real world for the final time. Stone of Trials. This engraved object was created to lead the chosen hero to the hidden location of the Triforce. 
obligatory quest item for a thing that you really wouldn't need an item for, but whatever, it doesn't really matter. And how is no one concerned that we just passed out on the floor here? Congratulations, Master. You have passed all the trials. The Stone of Trials you obtained is actually one of a pair, Master. Another similar object with a mark just like the one you hold exists somewhere on this island. Combining the two should open the way to the Triforce. I suggest you, uh, that you search for that matching stone. Before we do that, I gotta scratch my neck because it uh, is itchy for some reason. <laughs> uh, T, uh, TMO, or what, what the crap is it? Uh, T, TMI. TMI? Too much info? Anyway. One of the things I wanted to look for are the goddess chests. Or, well, goddess cubes. Apparently, we're, I think we're still missing one. Uh, or a couple, at least. There's none out on this field, I know that much. But, I want to at least go and look around again for any potential ones we may have missed. So, if there are none, I'll meet you guys back in Skyloft. If there are, then I'll skip ahead. So, see you guys in just a minute. Silver Rupee, hello! Give me that, give me that, you stupid bird. Give me that rupee, even though I don't need it. I'm greedy. Embodiment of greed. That was worth it. I missed one in Farron? How? Okay, I guess we're going over to Farron Woods. I really did not think I was missing one in Farron, but... Huh, okay, that's strange. I'm gonna feel like an idiot, though. Uh, is it right here? Wait, what? It's over by the Skyview Temple, I think. Let's see. The hell? Okay. Yeah, it's over by the Skyview Temple. Um... I do like to show this, because th this isn't the last time we ever come to these areas, like, there is no other point to coming to this, uh, these areas after, uh, doing the last thing we're about to do. Actually, after doing all the dragon stuff, there's no reason to come back here ever besides missing stuff, which, huh, funny enough, I'm apparently missing stuff. What chest am I, or what cube am I missing, though? Alright, it's gotta be somewhere out here on the left okay uh oh i remember why i missed it yeah okay 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 i know where this one's at i am stupid i'm just gonna quickly teleport to the temple entrance because well i'm late uh, stamina why i'm lazy so i'll i'll be right back over here i really did not want to go through the whole jumping puzzle of jumping across everything to get to this place so birds i think are a faster way of travel over here there's a grapple spot we launch ourselves up here launch yourself up here i completely forgot about this cube weirdly enough i i'm usually good about some of that stuff but uh huh Apparently I was missing it. Is that the only one? No, there's still... Maybe after I grab the chest. Uh, I'm gonna go up there real quick and grab that chest. Oh, I wanted that amber relic. See you guys in a sec. Oh, are you joking me? That's the one we were missing? The stupid one over by Beetle? Uh... Over on Beetle's Island, I am an idiot. I completely forgot about this chest being a thing, and well, now here we are. Please, be something at least useful. Oh, it's another rupee medal. Um, well, good thing I did that, because that was actually kind of important. Uh, is that it? There's still more. Alright, well, I'm gonna go check in Elden. I really don't think there's any in Elden, but, um... I'll go check in Elden, then I'll go check in uh, Lanayru, and so I'll be there in a sec. Alright, I couldn't find any other goddess cube chests around the other areas. Um, 
If I am missing one or two, then let me know. Um, they're probably not important, considering the last one we got was the last uh, rupee medal. Does it really... Yeah, I mean, it doesn't tell you... Like, it doesn't tell you which province out here, and I did go to the major areas in each province, and I didn't see anything besides the one in Farron, so... I think we do have them all. I'm not entirely sure, but, uh, I mean, you know, if we are missing some, that's just rupees or something, so. Anyway, this is a statue we've been looking for. You are now whole once again, Mr. Birdie. This has been here the entire time. Yeah, I hope you got that chest way back when. Because, <laughs> uh, it ain't there no more. That was hidden underneath Skyloft the entire time. The thing is bigger than the rock itself. A report, Master Link. My calculations indicate a 85% chance that the structure you uncovered houses the Triforce. Given this development, I project that the moment for Zelda to fulfill her destiny, uh, or the moment for, whatever, and bring the end to demise is close at hand. Yeah, you thought there was no more dungeons, huh? That is the final temple in the entire game. And we can take care of it right now. However, as you know, with my rule, I always do a dungeon as an entirety of its own video. And you're probably wondering, well, crap, this is a really fast video considering, well, I'm looking at the timestamp and it's probably only 19 or maybe 10 to 20 minutes. I wanted this video to be an unfinished business video, which means everything is unlocked at this point in time, pretty much, uh, except for the final fight and all that. If you need to take care of Thunder Dragon, or you need to get any of the other heart pieces, or any of the other collectibles, or anything like that, now is the time to do it. Now there's really nothing stopping you from doing this now and taking care of that later, but like I said, I wanted to take care of any unfinished businesses that may have arisen, and well, I apparently missed the goddess cube chest all that time ago. So, I'll say, next time on Skyward Sword, we'll be taking on the final temple. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.